Hello guys and welcome back to another episode of Chemistry and of course today we are going to continue our study on alkanos and very importantly we are going to be looking at the test chemistry okay we are going to be looking at the test and the uses of alkanos okay so please stick with us do not forget that this tutorial is brought to you by the one and only OTD School Jam CBT Practice app. It is all you need to succeed in your exam. If you want to succeed and not succeed, go and get the app immediately. We'll talk about the app in a moment. Let us see a question from the OTD School Jam CBT app. This is a 2009 question, number 44. It says, Lucas reagent is used to test for A, alkenes, B, alkanoic acid, C, alkanols, D, it means okay so we'll come back to this question and many more questions at the end of the class and not before so please ensure that you stay to the end of the class all right get the application the application has all the past questions from jam so for all subjects you don't need to worry to, about going to buy a past question anywhere once you have this application then of course there are lecture notes structured according to the jam syllabus a lot of you read without your jam syllabus or oh, your is for you all right so please ensure you get the app then lastly or thirdly, rather, there's what a question search feature where you can search for questions according to topics. And the question that Jam has asked from that topic will come out for you to answer. Is that not wonderful? Then there's a mock challenge every Saturday for all students that are writing Jam for this year. Okay, you compete with your mates in that mock challenge, get you to Jam pass question, get you to Jam likely exam question, see your score release every Saturday till one week to the main Jam exam. Therefore, you are able to track your progress and build your confidence. Many more features that are what wonderful on the applications. Okay. Okay? There are educational games there that you can watch, play while you are tired of studying. Okay, they are all there, all in a bid to help you to succeed. So please download the app. Activation fee is just a little token. Pay it and what and see that the Lord is good. So let us go to test and uses of alkanos. Okay, so the test that we use to distinguish between primary alkanos, primary alkanos, that is the one degree alkanos, the secondary alkanos. That is the two degree alkanos and the tertiary alkanos, what we call the three degree alkanos, is called the Lucas test. Lucas test. Please take note of this. Okay, so it is the Lucas test that we use in what distinguishing between what one degree, two degree, and three degree what alkanos. And what is this Lucas test? Okay, so this Lucas test, or rather the Lucas reagents. Okay, the Lucas reagent is added to what to an alcohol all right that we do not know all right whether it's what the primary or secondary or tertiary so we carry that locus reagent and then we add it to the alcohol all right so there are some observations you are supposed to want to see that will let you know that oh this alcohol where can i put locus reagent now primary alcohol or is secondary alcohol or is tertiary all right so you must take note of all these so now let us go. What is this Lucas reagent itself? This Lucas reagent itself is anhydrous, anhydrous zinc chloride. Okay, anhydrous zinc chloride with concentrated, with concentrated hydrochloric acid. Okay, so it's actually what anhydrous zinc chloride with concentrated what hydrochloric what acid that is what this lucas reagent so you carry this lucas reagent you what put it what in an alcohol and then you can see some observation that will let you know whether the alcohol is primary secondary or tertiary so now this is the general reaction okay you are going to see what uh, an alcohol like r o h okay then plus of course hcl all right then you have your z n c l 2 all right ZNCl2, then of course you now have what your ROCL, okay, which is an alkyl or halide, then what plus what now plus H2O. Okay, so this is the alcohol, all right. So this is your Lucas reagent. This then what you form what your alkyl halide, then get what water. So primary uh, uh, or halo alkenes, primary alkanos. Very importantly, primary alkanos do not form what haloalkenes under these conditions. Okay, they do not form 
they do not form what? A halo akins under this condition. So for that reason, you do not observe any precipitate. Okay? You do not observe any cloudiness. You do not observe any turbidity. You do not observe any precipitate. Okay? At room temperature. So for text for what? For primary aconos, right? So if you do not experience, so if you do not observe any precipitate. So for primary aconos, primary aconos, there's no precipitate. No PPT or turbidity. Okay, so this precipitate, okay, at room temperature. At room temperature. Take note of that. So we do not what experience any what cloudiness. We do not experience any turbidity. We do not observe any what precipitate at room temperature for primary arcanos. And because it's and because for primary arcanos do not form what halo akins under these conditions. Okay. But for secondary arcanos, okay. For secondary arcanos, uh, so, sorry, secondary arcanos, secondary arcanos, we observe a what cloudiness. We observe what cloudiness. Okay. Or PPT. Or well, can call it what? Uh, turbidity after five minutes, after five to ten minutes. Okay? At room temperature. Okay, please take note of that. So, for secondary arcanos, okay, we, we observe what? Cloudiness, PPT, or turbidity after five to ten minutes, just from between five to ten minutes, you should what? See what? Uh, this what uh, observation. This guys to tell you that what that alkanol is what it's a secondary what alkanol. Okay, but for tertiary alkanol, for tertiary alkanol, tertiary, for tertiary alkanol, right? It is what immediate. Okay, it is what instant. Okay, so the precipitate, the PPT, the turbidity. Okay, or the cloudiness. Okay, it's what? It's instant. It's instant at room temperature. Okay, so the Lucas test, all right? The Lucas test, or what? That now, what uh, that now gives us or the Lucas reagent is used for what? To distinguish between what? These classes of what? Of alcohol. So that primary, secondary, or tertiary alkanos. I hope that is very, very clear. All right, so you saw it in your exam question. So you do not play with anything. So they may tell you that. The Lucas test in the Lucas test for secondary arcanos, what is observed? So the observation or what uh, in under many minutes is the cloudiness observed in the for secondary arcanos in the Lucas test. Obviously, five to ten minutes for secondary. For primary, no cloudiness at all, no turbidity. Okay, at room temperature. All right, and the reason because what primary arcanos do not react to form halo akins under this condition. They do not react. Okay, so please do not form halo akins under this condition. So let us really see the uses of uh, alkanos and we are done with this class. Please do not forget to like this video. Liking this video will make other students easily find this video. Please, so that everybody will pass and succeed. We ensure that what you like, click on that like button now before you continue. And do not forget to what to subscribe to this channel. Subscription is free. If you have done that before, thank you very much. If you are not subscribed, click on the subscribe button immediately. And then, of course, do not forget to share. Keep sharing this video to your friends, to your loved ones. All right. Uh, now let us see the uses of alkanos. Okay, and alkanos, they are the main constituent. They are the main constituent of methylated spirits. You know methylated spirits now? That one that you used to put in your wood that will pepper you, it will be hot. Okay? So that one is used to clean wounds. Okay? So it's very, very important. Okay? It's used to what? To clean wounds. It's what? The main constituent of what? Of methylated spirits and used to what? Used to clean wounds. Used to clean wounds. Or what dissolve paint. It's also used to dissolve paint. Okay, so please take note of all of that. So I can also have what wonderful what uses. Okay, also it is used as petrol additive. It is used as petrol additive. Okay, it's just a word as petrol additive. That means what it is added to what to petrol. Okay, to what to make the petrol what more what efficient. Okay, so it is used as fuel. It is used as a petrol additive for use as what as fuel. Okay, for what for vehicle. It is used as petrol additives for use as fuel 
for what? For vehicles. Okay. Then uh, that's the second use that we'll talk about. Then thirdly, also, it is used to manufacture other other uh, chemicals. Okay. It is used to manufacture. Use it is used. All right. It is used to manufacture other chemicals like ethanoic acid okay it is used to manufacture what other chemicals like ethanol and what and ethanoic what acid so that's another use of what of alkanos okay the fine uses also as um, the ingredient for making uh, alcoholic drinks there are also ingredients number four the uh ingredients for making alcoholic so if you that drink better stop drinking alcoholic what uh drinks okay like beers okay even like spirits like beers like spirits like wines like wines okay and what and spirits Okay, so these are all what the uses of what of art and loss. There may be more, but I be plus. Just keep these ones at the back of what of your mind. So let us go to the app, answer the question we are done with this class. Uh, 2009, number 44. Lucas reagent is used to test for A, alkanes, B, alkanoic acid, C, alkanos, and D, amines. Correct answer there is what is alkanos, all right, or alcohols. Okay, so please, uh, Lucas reagent is what we say it's anhydrous and hydrous. Zinc chloride and hydros zinc chloride. Okay, with what now? With concentrated, with concentrated hydrochloric acid. This is what Lucas reagent. It is used to identify between or identify between what primary, secondary, and what and tertiary. I can also differentiate between them. My name is Master T, the Grand Commander of the Old Three Schools Army. As a soldier, you must keep working, you must keep studying. That is all that matters to you at this point. Get into school and be the person you want to become. All right. So, see you in the next class. We'll talk about was carboxylic acids. Thank you for watching.